is Jane from the Youngsters. If you remember from previous videos, our model train set is now in a trundle. Yay! Because of that, we need to be careful with the height of buildings we buy. They must be less than six inches. We also need to be careful about how long the train is, because the radius is small and we don't want the trains to derail. The outer track is 18 inches and the inner track is 15 inches. And finally, my dad wanted to get a tr car transport for the two HOCL cars we have. Awesome. To help us out along the way, create a checklist for all the things we need to do in this video. Normally, we buy all the stuff on Amazon. But this time on the way to Legoland, we found an awesome train store. It's called Arnie's Model Train Store. At the train store, we found a train station that wasn't tall at all. It was only $40. Here's a quick speedwell for something that took several hours to do. This build was really fun because it was my first time making a model and I had to use like really special glue. Speed build! Use the prize bar at the top to see how long the speed build is. Here it is all nice and done. It's an Amtrak station, but we didn't want that, so we didn't put the signs up. In the future, we'll get different signs and put those on. Here's what under the train station looks like. Let's double check if it fits. And we'll do that by closing up the trundle. It fits! Yay! Low train station, check. Here's one of the two well cars that fit on the 15 inch radius. They're hard to find because they don't make them anymore, but the link is in the description below. Let's open it up. Here's what the 40 foot well car looks like. Since Bachman doesn't make well cars, we got rebuilt welters 40 foot well car because normally it's 53 foot or so these longer well cars have trouble over the smaller turning radiuses as you can see the coupler is attached to the well car and not the wheels which fits perfectly with the rest of our trains we can't have a train with only one well car so we bought two let's put some containers on it Here's the well cars attached to your train and we stack the containers. Well cars, check. So next, our challenge was to find a passenger train to match our Santa Fe Super Chief. Remember at the beginning of the video, Arnie's train store on the way to Legoland? I think it was the owner. He found these two used passenger cars. They said Santa Fe on the side. They were silver and they matched the style of su the Super Chief. Because they were used, they only cost $7. And here's the first car attached to the Super Chief. 
Here's the end car, and we're so lucky that they had the end car. By the way, these are plastic cars, not metal. And here are all the cars attached to the Super Chief. Passenger car, check. And finally, the car transport. What's really cool about having a dad that also likes small trains is that he will buy his own rolling stock that I too can play with. The car transport was out of what I was allowed to spend, but since my dad really liked it, he got it for himself. A long time ago, we found two HO scaled NAS cars, so this was perfect. Now let's attach it to the train. And with the cars added, it looks so cool. Car transporter, check. Now that the checklist is complete, there's only one thing left to do, to see it in action. That's the end of our video. Don't forget to like and subscribe so we can keep making these awesome videos.